Hey everyone, how are you doing? This is Robert from Helton's Computer Repair here with another quick tutorial. On this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to uninstall Discord. Yes, I am actually shocked hearing this one, but there are sometimes if you had a problem on your computer, it doesn't want to work correctly, like Discord's not working right. Or let's say if you don't like Discord or somehow someone told you to remove it or your friend pretty much might have told you to get rid of it because they don't want you to talk to other people, if you know what I mean. This will pretty much be showing you just how to uninstall this program. So let's just go ahead and jump right into this tutorial. So the first thing you do is pretty much just go ahead and go to start. And then from that point you will choose settings. Then choose apps. When you get there, it might take a little bit for the system to load. And once it finally loads, you'll see the list of programs and you'll choose the Discord for it. From there, you'll choose the uninstall options and this will probably come up telling that the apps and its related info will be uninstalled. You'll select it and you'll probably be prompted for this to be done. For a time, I'm actually going to press no because it seems that some people have a problem that underneath the apps and features, it doesn't want to show the program there. Like it could be missing, like literally not showing here. So to fix this option, if it's not there, you can go to start menu and you can type in control panel. I just typed in control on the search bar and opened up control panel. Then choose programs and programs and features. And when you get to there, you'll see a list of programs. And here's the one again called discord. Select that same program. You can double tap it or you can just select the uninstall button. And I'll take you to the same spot right here prompting you again. Did I select it or is it taking a little second? Oh, it just literally uninstalled it right there without even asking for it. On the other one, it asked us to prompt us. This one didn't even matter. It just uninstalled it like nothing. But that seems that it will be good and you shouldn't have problems for this system to be uninstalled. Right now, I don't see it on the desktop anymore. I'm going to start and I don't see the program anymore. If it's possibly still there, I would just say give your computer a restart and you should be good. But for the rest, you, sh you should be done with this program being gone. Thank you for watching from Helton's Computer Repair, and I will see you on a next video. Thanks for watching, guys. If you just like this video, then hit that button. But if you like it and you want to see more, hit that like button. Get subscribed, comment, and tell us what other tech videos you want to see. Consider checking out our merch store. Link in the video description. And for the rest, I will see you on the next video.